not every secret spot is a physical location. Some secret spots are actually in space. And this is exactly what we'll check out in this episode. Let me show you. So before I get into showing you how to find the International Space Station using your iPhone, I thought I'd get into a brief history of what the International Space Station is. The short word for it is ISS. So the International Space Station is actually a research laboratory. A lot of people don't know this, but uh, you know, a lot of research actually takes place at the International Space Station. That's, that's actually what it was sort of built for. They do a lot of experiments in biology, human biology, physics, astronomy, meteorology, and many other fields. The first component of the ISS was launched in 1998, and it's been expanded ever since. So it's much bigger than the very first component that was sent in 1998, clearly, because they add more parts to it. And it's called the International Space Station because it's actually shared. Truth of the matter is, it's separated into two segments, a Russian orbital segment, which is operated by Russia, and a United States orbital segment, which is shared by many nations, not just the United States. So the Russian part of the space station is shared by them alone, and the U.S. part is shared amongst Japan, Germany, and many other countries. You could actually find a list of all the countries that share the International Space Station with the United States. That being said, I now want to show you how to find when the space station is coming over your sky. You, you see it orbits the Earth very rapidly, a number of times per day, and you could actually track when it's going to be visible over in your sky, and that's what I'm going to show you how, you how to do. That's what you're actually seeing my mentor point at. He's pointing at the space station coming towards our way, so let's do this. Let's hope we could see there something. It is right there. Where? Oh, there it is. Yeah. I see it. And it's actually moving. Of course it's moving. It goes around <laughs> the Earth every hour and a half. So it's moving around. So the space station goes around the Earth every hour and a half. Yeah. So the wind totally took over and I couldn't just let the video play out like this because all you would hear is the wind. We were on a very high floor and watching... Uh, the space station from this floor is kind of cool because, you know, uh, it gives you improved visibility. But at the same time, you know, it's, it's a lot of wind up there. Anyway, um, it turns out that the space station orbits the Earth about 16 times per day. And watching it at the sky is a very cool experience. And I consider that a secret spot. As you know, uh, I'm one of the founders of Cityscape and I usually promote Cityscape, my app which is a way to find secret spots around the city. But I thought this was cool enough to be considered a secret spot. Unfortunately, you can't just download the Cityscape app and find a sta space station, right? You're going to have to download the NASA app to find a space station. And here's how to do it. So download the NASA app. And once you have it downloaded, click on it. Once it's open, click on missions. And once you have missions loaded up, you have to find the International Space Station, which is somewhere down the menu. Once you find it, click on it. And it should look up a page uh, of the International Space Station. Uh, now scroll down and go to Maps. Click on Maps. And once you're at Maps, it should show you where the space station is. So I'm currently in Hawaii. And you know, this is me. Now it's showing the space station, which is currently going over Haiti, Dominican Republic, which is actually where I'm from, ironically. I'm actually from Haiti. I'm not from Dominican Republic. I'm from the you know country next to it, Haiti. And it's quite ironic that it's uh, the International Space Station is actually right over my country, my original country. I'm, I'm an American now, clearly, but uh, cool. Unfortunately, you can't really use the Cityscape app to find the space station. However, if you want to find secret spots in your city, be sure to get Cityscape for that. That's it for this episode, guys. I'll see you next time. Scout life.